Hi, I am Dr. Nikhil Gupta. I am a diabetes and endocrinology specialist at the CanMed Multi-Specialty and Weight Management Clinics in the Toronto area in Canada. Today we are going to talk about how to use the Ozempic pen. Ozempic is also known as semaglutide. It is a medicine that is used for treatment of diabetes. It is not an insulin. Before you use this medicine, please make sure that you have discussed the benefits and side effects with your doctor or healthcare professional and this medicine has been prescribed to you by a healthcare professional. So moving on to the medication, it is called Ozempic as we discussed and it comes in a box like this and it also comes with a box of needles that are used to inject the medicine uh, into our body. So <clears throat> to use the pen, the, the pen already comes pre-filled with the medicine which is a clear liquid which we have to make sure that it is clear before we use it and it is used along with the needle. So here is how we use the pen. So we remove this plastic wrap from behind the needle and we screw the needle onto the pen like this. After that we take the big cap out and we also take the smaller cap out. The big cap we will use later to remove the needle from the pen after we have injected the medication. So how does the dosing work? This pen uh, has 0.25 milligram or 0.5 milligram dose delivery options. There's another pen which comes which delivers one milligram uh, which is a higher dose. Um, so in the beginning your doctor might tell you to deliver a lower dose so we are going to talk about that. So when we f use a new pen out of the box then for the first time we have to use what we, what we call is priming the pen. So we have to go to this marker here which has two dots and we have to make sure that we push it out and we see a drop in, in the pen to make sure that the, the pen and the medication and the needle are communicating and the pen is working. We do not have to do this step at subsequent injections with the same pen. We always do it for the first time. Now to deliver the actual dose, we go again, we look at the dose window here and we go to the first, usually the first lowest dose which is 0.25 milligrams. We dial that, we already have our needle in place and what we do is we usually inject it in our belly, in our abdomen and it has to be at least two finger breadths away from the belly button. It could be more as well. So it has to be at least one inch away from the belly button to the sides on the abdomen. And then what we do is we do not have to pinch the skin of the belly. We go straight in like this, 90 degrees. We press the injector and then hold for five seconds and remove the medication, uh, the pen. So it is a very straightforward, simple process. And the dosing works, usually the way the dosing works is that in the first four weeks, you use a lower dose of 0.25 milligram once a week. Remember this pen, this dose is usually used once a week, not more frequently than that. So you have to set up a reminder to use it on a certain day of the week. It can be with or without a meal. And after four weeks, if your doctor has recommended, then you might be asked to increase the dose to 0.5 milligram once a week. However, this depends on the discretion of your healthcare provider. So after we are done with the injection, we have to use the big cap. We put it on the pen, push it all the way in and unscrew it so that the needle and the cap come out. And this has to be disposed into a sharps container, not the regular garbage. So we keep that away safely and we close the pen which can be stored at room temperature for up to 8 weeks. So that was how to use an Ozempic pen for management of diabetes. Thank you.